Do you know if having a chocolate spread with better ingredients leads to a lower blood sugar spike compared to Nutella? Let's find out. Today I'm trying the almond silk spread from Twiddles. Because the ingredients are clean. It's 70% nuts and seeds and it's sweetened by jaggery. In contrast, Nutella is basically sugar and palm oil. So there's a big difference in the ingredients. I've used 2 tablespoons to make these sandwiches and in total they should be around 425 calories. Let's see what happens. Tastes pretty good. Let's see what my glucose monitor says. 39 mg increase. Another amazing result. For comparison, when I had jam sandwiches with the same 4 slices of white bread, my blood sugar levels had increased by 64 mg. Much higher than this. The high spike for jam sandwiches does make sense because I used Kisan mixed fruit jam, which had almost 70% sugar with about zero of fat. And I'll show you something interesting. When I had Nutella sandwiches, my blood sugar levels had increased by 48 mg, lower than jam sandwiches. And this makes sense because Nutella has less total sugar and more fat compared to jam. And the Twiddles chocolate spread gave an even lower result because it had lower total sugar and higher fat than even Nutella. So basically, as the proportion of sugar came down and fat went up, the sugar spike kept coming down. And that's why it's important to read nutrition labels. This series clearly shows that better ingredients do matter from a blood sugar perspective. 